and welcome. I'm the Candyman, and you're watching a Pocket Tips on State of Decay 2. That's right, we're back with more a Pocket Tips, the series where we give you, the viewer, tips and tricks on how to better survive the zombie apocalypse. Now, if you have a tip or trick you feel like would be helpful for other survivors to know, go ahead, leave a comment down below and you might see it featured in the next video. Now, if you find this video helpful, go ahead, drop a like. Also, consider subscribing as well, and you'll get better at surviving the zombie apocalypse. I promise. Alright, so today's apocalypse tip is a breakdown of each and every textbook that can be found within the game. Now, when used correctly, textbooks can help you maximize your character's skill set. So what we're going to do today is we're going to go through each of the three different types of textbooks that can be found or traded for in the game and show you exactly how they affect your character. Let's get to it. So first, we will talk about the community skill textbooks. All right, so these allow you to teach a community skill to one of your survivors if they don't already have one, um, and that being a fifth skill in place already. Um, they can also be used to improve the basic community skills and specializations that your survivor already has. All right, so the first textbook that we'll talk about is chemistry. So this allows you to teach a survivor the basics of chemistry, or you can improve their chemistry, munitions, or pharmacology skill. Next up, we have computers. This will help you teach them the basics of computers, or you can improve their computers, electronics, or programming skill. Next up, we have the cooking textbook. Uh, so this will teach you, or I should say your survivor, cooking, or they can improve their cooking, cuisine, or nutrition skill. Then we have craftsmanship. So here, you can learn the basics of craftsmanship, or improve craftsmanship, construction, or metalwork. Then we have gardening. So gardening, again, will teach you the basics of gardening, or it can improve your gardening, agriculture, or herbalism skill. Then we have the mechanics textbook. So here, again, you'll learn the basics of mechanics, or you can improve that mechanic skill, auto mechanics, or engineering. Then we have medicine, so it'll be able to teach your survivor the basics of medicine or they can improve their medicine skill, surgery, or pathology. And then finally we have the utilities textbook, which again you know, teaches you the basics, uh, or it can improve the survivor's uh, utilities, electrical, or plumbing skill. Okay, let's talk a little bit about quirk skills now. So while there are a bunch of different quirk skills in the game, there's only 10 that you can learn through textbooks, and they are as follows. Driving, fishing, hygiene, lichenology, recycling, scrum, secret shopper, sewing, sleep psychology, and finally, soundproofing. And our final type of textbook are the training manuals. So the training manuals allow you to re-specialize your survivor's core skills. The thing is though, the survivor must already have their core skills specialized before they're able to use any of the four um, the, any of the four training manuals. And the four specializations as you can see are combat, firearms, mental, and physical. Now if you do use one of these manuals, uh, be aware that you are going to get a negative trait. Um, so you do get penalized. Um, it basically decreases that uh, particular skills experience rate by 66%. Um, so you got to put, put in more effort to get the same amount of experience that you would if you hadn't used the manual. So we'll probably go into a video, or I should say make a video in the future, uh, breaking down the training manuals. Uh, but for now, these are the three types of textbooks available for you. So if you found this video helpful, do me a favor. Uh, hit the like button and consider subscribing as well. Every bit helps. As always, spread the love, spread the positivity, and I'll catch you in the next one.